I give the floor now to the wife of Leonidas and Queen of Sparta. Councilmen, I stand before you not only as your queen, I come to you as a mother. I come to you as a wife. I come to you as a Spartan woman. I come to you with great humility. I am not here to represent Leonidas. His actions speak louder than my words ever could. I am here for all those voices which cannot be heard. Mothers, daughters, fathers, sons. 300 families that bleed for our rights and for the very principles this room was built upon. We are at war, gentlemen. We must send the entire Spartan army to aid our king in the preservation of not just ourselves, but of our children. Send the army for the preservation of liberty. Send it for justice. Send it for law and order. Send it for reason. But most importantly, send our army for hope. Hope that a king and his men have not been wasted to the pages of history. That their courage bonds us together. That we are made stronger by their actions. And that your choices today reflect their bravery. Eloquent, passionate, but it doesn't change the fact that your husband has brought war upon us. You are wrong. Xerxes brought it forth, and before that his father Darius at Marathon. The Persians will not stop until the only shelter we will find is rubble and chaos. This chamber needs no history lesson, my queen. Then what is the lesson you would like to leave? Should I begin to enumerate all of them? Honor, duty glory you speak of honor and duty and glory but what of adultery how dare you how dare i watch her carefully she is a trickster in true form do not play with the members of this sacred chamber my queen just hours ago you offered yourself to me were i a weaker man I would have her sent on me still. This is outrage. Ah, the hypocrite speaks. Did you not receive a similar payment, which you took in exchange for her having an audience with these noble men? That is a lie. Is it? Was he not, by your invitation, asked to come to the king's bedchamber, the very bed where you attempted to negotiate with me so vigorously? You look shocked. A bribe of the flesh, gentlemen, while her husband promotes anarchy and war. Words escape even the most cunning tongue. My little whore queen. <laughs> what queen-like behavior. Remove her from this chamber before she infects us further with her inglorious and shabby self. This will not be over quickly. You will not enjoy this. I am not your queen. Traitor! Traitor! 